Welcome back to Design Mindscape. In this video, we delve deep into the world of Japandi, a design philosophy that's more than just a trend. It's where the ancient traditions of Japanese Zen gardens meet the modern, airy aesthetics of Scandinavian homes. Now let's take a closer look at the foundational elements that give Japandi its unique charm, the architectural details. Japandi style homes often have wooden beams on the ceiling. They're usually made of oak. Most of the time, these beams are left just the way they are when cut from the tree, or they're given a slight tint. This makes the house feel more comfortable and homey. Sliding screens and wooden wall slats are important elements in Japandi interior design. They provide flexibility and practicality, making it easy to change the layout of spaces according to the current needs. For example, during the day, these sliding screens can be opened up to let more natural light in. Natural wood flooring is a must in a Japandi home. The choice of finish, whether a dark stain or a natural pale oak, really depends on your preference. But remember, the key is to maintain that connection with nature and the sense of tranquility it brings. But what really brings Japandi to life? It's more than just a style or a look. It's about how things are made. In Japandi, craftsmanship, especially using methods that care for the environment, is crucial. This comes from both Japanese and Scandinavian cultures which value using natural, renewable resources. Each item in a room is more than a simple object. It's a testament to the skill of the artisan and a reflection of a commitment to environmental responsibility. Take furniture, for example. Handmade pieces crafted from sustainably sourced wood embody the essence of the Japandi style. The intricate details of the wood grain, the rich scent of the timber, and the smoothness of the surface come together to create a sensory experience. This experience not only celebrates the raw beauty of nature, but also honors the masterful skills of the craftsman. Similarly, decor items made of recycled or repurposed materials are not just creative expressions, but profound statements of sustainable living. An old glass bottle, when transformed into a beautiful flower vase, or wooden pallets repurposed into a chic coffee table, resonate with the very soul of Japandi's philosophy. These aren't merely decorative pieces. They are wonderful examples of how Japandi's approach to sustainability and craftsmanship harmonizes the practical with the aesthetic, turning the ordinary into something truly extraordinary. Now let's talk about another important aspect of the Japandi style, the color palette. Japandi combines the peaceful and natural colors inspired by Japanese aesthetics with the clean and muted tones typical of Scandinavian design. The colors used in Japandi style come from nature, and they help create a calm and balanced feeling. The main background colors are warm and neutral, like white, beige, and light gray. These colors are clean and bright, making a room feel bigger and more open. This contributes to the peaceful and quiet feeling that this style is known for. Depth in the Japandi background is achieved by layering darker, earthy tones, such as charcoal, deep brown, or muted greens. These colors are inspired by nature and they bring a sense of warmth and richness to the space. After exploring the color palette, let's move to texture and materials. In a Japandi space, textures create a sensory experience. The smooth touch of polished wood, the gentle embrace of organic cotton, or the warm comfort of a wool rug all contribute to the room's character. These textures add depth and create a tactile landscape that's both calming and engaging. Materials in Japandi design are chosen not just for looks, but also for their sustainability. Natural and eco-friendly elements like wood, bamboo, and organic fabrics are key. Each material, with its unique texture and color, adds variety and depth to the space. Let's shift our attention from texture and materials to light. Light plays a vital role in creating a peaceful and calming atmosphere in the room. 
In Japandi design, natural light is very important. The rooms are made to let in as much daylight as possible to make them look bigger and feel happier. Big windows, glass doors, and skylights are used a lot. They are often left without covers or have thin curtains, so the sunlight can fill the room. In Japandi design, the type of lighting you choose is very important. Items like handmade paper lanterns, wooden lamps, or basic hanging lights can make a room glow warmly. This glow is soft, like a sunset, and it helps the room feel calm and welcoming. In this style, light is more than something to see by. It's used to make the space feel comfortable and just right. As we delve deeper into the Japandi aesthetic, let's now explore an aspect that brings life and natural beauty indoors, the inclusion of indoor plants. Indoor greenery serves multiple purposes in Japandi interiors. Firstly, it adds a splash of color and life to the neutral minimalist color palette. Secondly, plants add another layer of texture to the space. The glossy leaves of a monstera, the feathery fronds of a fern, or the succulent leaves of a jade plant all contribute to the rich textural landscape of a Japandi interior. Choosing the right plant for your space is not only about matching the light conditions, but also about expressing the look you want. If you want a strong Japanese influence, you might consider bonsai trees, as their carefully shaped forms add a special touch. On the other hand, snake plants with their upright and structured leaves align more with the modern Scandinavian aspect of Japandi, giving a unique way to emphasize that side of the design. As we delve into the Japandi style, one essential principle that resonates with both Japanese and Scandinavian designs is the practice of decluttering. This goes beyond mere cleanliness and simplicity. It's a core aspect of Japandi. In Japandi interiors, less is more. Rooms are not crowded with unnecessary stuff or fancy decorations. Instead, each piece of furniture, decor item, and even plants are carefully chosen. Everything has a purpose and fits in well with the functionality and look of the space. In Japandi style, keeping things tidy is key. Furniture with storage built in, or shelves and baskets made of natural materials, help hide things but keep them easy to get to. This way, the space stays looking calm and beautiful. There you have it, a look into Japandi design. From blending Japanese elegance with Scandinavian simplicity to embracing nature and mindful living, this style is all about balance and comfort. Whether you're sprucing up a room or just curious about design, I hope you found some inspiration here. Thanks for joining me at Design Mindscape. If you liked this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.